Hello everybody, the liquid cartridge here. So, I'm currently streaming this live right now. And uh we're doing we're doing some spooky games that I found on itch. And um it's kind of awkward since I've technically already been live for like 8 minutes and I'm doing an intro. So it's like doubly awkward having like a couple people sit in on this. But yeah, let's go ahead and kick off with the game if I can get into it uh this is vacation island this is a second time for me explaining this uh this is the animal crossing horror archetype n64 styled game um i'll be leaving all the links of the games in the description below and whatnot i also have a mad vent that i'm going to be doing uh later that i'm also going to post the link of you want to like, you know, download and play these games by all means. So let's 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 go ahead and kick this off. Uh, charity draws as good as my brother. She'll be good as me. <laughs> Lol. Ooh, excuse me. She sent me four inhalers, all with three hundred puffs. Nice. What the fuck is this? Oh, 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 okay, I can move. That's a... That's a face. Oh. No, no textures. Whoa. Weird. Oh. Old amnesia vibes? Get out of here. Let's say amnesia. Bring me eight humans and some ghosts. Ugh. Ugh. I don't like this face. Oh, wait, there's ghosts over here. It's a gross HUD, but I like it. Definitely gives you, a uh, creepy vibes. understand what I'm doing. Oh. Oh, wait. Am I... Oh, do I drag it back to the thing? Is it choked? This is very weird. Can I read this? I can't. I am looking for humans to consume. Oh, 
I'm not gonna lie, it creeps me out every time I like look at the dude. I just turn around and he's just there, choking on whatever with his weird humanoid eyes. Or re semi realistic eyes is the term, not humanoid. Humanoid describes body features that don't strictly inhibit. It's like animals when they. It, it anthropomorphize is like humanoid. Hey! Mind if I charm you? And now there's two of them. Okay, cool. Yeah, so I can just collect the humans while I'm collecting the ghosties. This is so weird. Vader's voice, force choking the lad. Hey, yo! Get force choked. Dark ass forest. But I see me some ghosties. That's a wall. Alright, cool. It's like I'm whispering dark nothings into them. Very weird. Yes? Question mark? I need to find a way to get into the village. I think I'm gonna have to take the upside over here. I mean, I've had this camera angle before, I just don't, um... I don't usually use it without the green screen. I think the side angle does me more justice than anything else. You know how their old fairy tale, old fairy tale ch were children trying to wander outside the village at night? I wonder if you're the thing that warned them about. Probably. Is there a way to get into the village? Maybe I go underneath through the river? I doubt it. Oh! I just walk on top of the fucking trees! Hell yeah! Emotes! Emotes for days! You got your, your, uh, your PS4 back? Nice. We should play some FF14 tonight because it's Thursday and it's a very chill night. Hello, person hiding in the water. I will grab you in a second. Oh, weird ass children.
360 no scope. I love how my FOV changes. How many children do I got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven? I think I need one more. Because he said eight, right? The Dark Lord demands eight children. I don't think I'm missing any ghosts. I really hope not. I'm missing f four ghosts. And I'm missing four ghosts. I need to go back. I don't want to like not give the Dark Lord what he deserves. If I'm gonna be honest, I just kind of want to chill today. That's fair, I guess. Hey, Wolf, that DRG game is on sale. For $10, even cheaper than last time I seen the deal. Ah, there's my last goat. Shall give the Dark Lord his penance, and he will eat upon the souls of the damned. Noise. What am I doing? What am I doing? Oh, is this the same map, but like none of the textures? Where am I supposed to go? Guessing this way? Maybe? Oh. That's kind of lame. There's nothing else that I can do. They're just... I brought you your servants, Dark Lord. Why you not give me power? You promised me power beyond my comprehension. Well, I guess that's it for this one. That that was a quick game. There we go. The Lacerator. The Lacerator. Yo! Resident Evil. Let's fucking go. Introducing Max, the man who loves sex. <laughs> it was just another sexy job. Another sexy woman. Oh no! Everything went wrong. Did I make an oopsie? What? Wait a minute. No, I didn't. Okay, I didn't make an oopsie. <laughs> what the fuck, dude? I went into that completely fucking blind. I was not expecting that. <laughs> Meet the Lacerator. The man who loves sex. 
<laughs> I was not expecting that, dude. I was not expecting that. I was... Oh, God, that's funny as hell. Oh, weird tank controls. The mouse you can use to twist your character, and then you move forward. Nice, though. I like this. What is that run animation? What the fuck? Hey, you. I'm the man who loves sex. <laughs> You're not an intellectual. You're a fake and a fraud. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Uh, yeah, Deep Rock Galactic. Uh, yes. I'm gonna get my ass handed to me, aren't I? How do I use bandages? My whole life, I was a lazy husband. I always asked my wife to put on bandages on me. Now I don't know how to use them. I remember she once said something like, Press tab to open your inventory, then select bandage. Finally click on use. This applies to any item. But though, I... But I thought she was crazy. But I though she was crazy. Is that how it really works? Someone, a lazy husband. This is an amazing game. I'm so glad that this one piqued my interest. The Lacerator. A man who loves set. I'm just in case. Just in case. Yes, he is smoking. Okay, I can't open the door, so that's cool. I'll just have to walk off screen, because even though they're they're really poorly modeled, you know, can't take chances. Yo! There's a sharp metal hooked in his eye. Will you take it? The hole. Day one. Holy shit, this place has no exits. I can't believe I'm gonna die here. Day two. Alright, I found a way out. There's a hole behind cell E. If I could only open that door, I would I would escape from this hell. My whole body is shaking. The lacerator almost got me. If anyone is reading this, beware of cell A. The lacerator comes from there, or maybe fuck. Maybe I switched the cells. Someone with courage. Look at that strut. Look at that strut. You can tell by the way I walk. I'm a woman's man. No time to talk. With a love, you must understand. We can look the other way. Oh no! I worked with Stacy many times. She doesn't seem okay right now, but damn, is she hot! Great game. I'd play this. I'd play a full fucking game of this. There's a fucking revolver? Yo. Get get me the seventies bass riff.
we're about to go ham on this. Yo! What the fuck? I just fucking, like, lost my arm. Oh my god. Oh yeah! Dude, this is great. Oh, enter the code. I don't got no code. I don't got the code. Yo, buddy, what's up? Mind if I just, uh... Mind if I just, uh... What the fuck just went all over my foot? God damn. Alright, let's, uh... A boost game. I will take that bandage. I made a post in the board and the server. Absolutely, go check it out so you can give her suggestions. What's in that box? I managed to unlock my cell today, but this place is a maze. I couldn't escape. At least I explored this area, and two things got my attention. One, there's a box with a number lock. I didn't try any code, but the man on the wall told me it's the number of victims. Last time I saw on the news, it was 86, but I know he got three more people this week, or maybe four. Uh, two, there's a revolver on the table, but... It's an obvious trap only a fool would fall for. Maybe there's a way to turn it off. Explorer. You know, I'm curious. Could I retry it without losing my arm and get, like, better aim and shit? I'm not gonna go in that hole yet. That hole looks scary. We're going to try 86. Wrong code. We're going to try 89. Wrong code. Okay, then it has to be... It has to be 90. Okay. Well... That's a lot of victims that, um, amounted to nothing. You get to spend money on me? No. Stop it. Stop spending money on me. It's locked from the other side. Okay.
Okay, no difference in interaction. The man who loves sex. Because spending your money on me is not good. Don't spend your money on me. Don't bring guns to the movies, you know? Don't escape. Bullshit, I'm out of here. Hmm. This is gonna be a little bit confusing. No. No. What? Is, wait, is that a? That's a fucking switch up there. I could have... Yeah, I could have turned off the thing. I'm gonna try 87. Eight six three four maybe, I don't know. They they don't specify like how many numbers are in the code, so that's a good point. Oh, I don't have those turned on. Very random, the piece that's just gonna go into the video. Eight, six, three, four. Eight, six, four. Oh, excuse me. There's there's a total of three slots. You haven't slept in nearly 18 hours? What are you doing on here? Go to sleep. Maybe it's based off of how many people are there and are dead currently. Doubtful, because then that would just be three. Maybe two. Well, actually, no, if that were the case, it would be, that would be four extra victims.
No, it's not 1690. I'm uncertain of what the code could be. There's four victims here currently. Me, co-star, person I just shot, and then the person that was in the chair. Wait a minute. I doubt it, but is the cell that he was in labeled? I can't see up there, so I can't tell for certain. Maybe there's something I missed underneath the bed, perhaps? No. I don't know what the code is. Is there like a better hint? There's like no other hints. There's not a whole lot to interact with. I'm literally uncertain what to do here.
Is there like a thing? There we go. That's what I am talking about. There's a thing up there. I'm probably gonna die. And I don't mind dying, because then I can retry this. You are die. You are dead. A fucking... It was just another sexy job. Fine. Fine. Oh, great. Okay. Yeah. No! No, beast. I'm not doing this. No. We are not... We are not doing this. Not today. Beast knows what he's doing. He shouldn't be doing that. Last time someone managed to discover the complex code on the big box, but now I switched it, and no one will ever know the code, so it's obviously it hurts. I switched it to one 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 one. Well, I don't remember how many ones, but it's just one till the end. Oh, okay. Well, now we know the code. Well, okay, come on, I can't push it? God damn it. I knew Beast was gonna go for that. I knew Beast was gonna go for that.
I didn't lose an arm to him, what do you mean? Wait, I can... We. You are Cliff, a college student who is brand new freelance cameraman for the show Paranormal and... Alright, Clint, uh, Cliff, 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 welcome to the St. Augustine's Asylum for the Mentally Ill. My producer Tom said good things about you. In your backpack is a flashlight, a voice recorder, an EMF, and a couple of little fun occult things. We'll let you know when to take those out. Ready to pay off some of those college debts and beer tabs? Well, of course you are. And when you're ready, enter in through those front doors. That's a brain scan over someone's face. Paranormal entities. Uh, nothing. All right, let's try this again. All right, all right, let's try this. Ghosts of St. Augustine, please let us know that you are still in this hospital. I give you permission to reveal yourself. I give you permission to come to life. Just give us a sign that you are here. Tell us where you are. <laughs>
Oh, bo oh wow, the mouse is not working properly. Oh, okay, let's pause for a second. Where am I supposed to be fucking going? I don't like it. I don't want to look at my screen. A summoning ceremony, huh? I think I will. Also, because you guys have been using that, I should be turning it on. Also, I'm going to check my food real quick. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I got my my food. Sorry about that. What 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 did I miss? I was talking. We were talking about fear. What are you scared of? Cause honestly, paranormal stuff scares me most. The dark, but mostly heights, open water, any certain spiders. Paranormal stuff is a th is a thing that isn't to be messed with. My legs start to shake unwillingly when I go to the top floor of a hotel. Cause I believe in paranormal stuff. I. I don't believe in paranormal stuff, but I'm also, like, a superstitious kind of guy, so, like, I, I'd say my biggest fear is the fear of uh, not knowing, because, again, as people, we, we like to, we like to imagine the worst outcome, like, naturally, 
And so when we're in a dark space, we fill the void with whatever our mind comes up with. There could be like a scary monster, a murderer, a ghost on the other side of that abyss that we're staring into. It's why it stares back at us because it's like, <laughs> we don't know what's on the other side of that thing. I don't like outcomes, okay? If I don't have control over the outcomes, if I don't have the control over what's going to happen next, if I don't know what's going to happen, fuck that. <laughs> fuck dealing with that. If I ain't prepared for it, thinking on my feet is one of my, like, I, I, I suck at that, okay? Fear of the unknown is, like, the number one fear for everybody, I think, and nobody wants to admit that. Because, you know, we don't know what's gonna happen next. It's why we fear death. We don't know what's happening next. Christians like to say they know, but we don't know. We honestly don't fucking know. This is a bomb ass sandwich. No, nah, dude. No, nah, dude. You know, I'd be willing to go to abandoned places, like, with a group of people, but, like, by myself? Fuck no. Fuck no. Absolutely. Absolutely, Beast. He was extremely manipulative and very intelligent. He was a murderer and a memer. Most of his victims could never identify him because he managed to convince them to gouge their own eyes out with metal wires and even their own fingernails. He came here to the legal loopholes, and when the facility went off the rails and the doctor stopped caring, he jumped into action. The patients who didn't listen were tortured, and the ones who did wandered around the facility, blind, I legit want to get a group together and like spend the night in like Alcatraz. Cause how cool would it be to spend the night in Alcatraz? Oh, that's a gross ass lobotomy.
lives inside this asylum. We know that you're here. We release you from I'm, the restraints. I'm, nah. Come nah. forward and live again. This person is no longer shielded from the realm of the dead. You may be seen, interact, and manipulate him in any way as you see fit. Oh, sacrifice me. Fuck you, dipshit. Fucking asshole. No! No! You've sacrificed me to the undead. You think I'm gonna go check it out? If I were a smart person, and you set me here by myself, I would have just left. Okay? The smart thing to do would be say, fuck this guy. He just sacrificed me. I don't want to turn around. I don't want to turn around. I don't want to turn around. I'm looking at OBS because I feel like it'd make myself feel better if I turned around. But, um, I don't want to turn around. Oh, they opened a doorway. That's fun. I'm gonna look at the ground. <laughs> Fuck you! Fuck the guy who set me on this! Fuck everyone around me! No. No. Did I fucking mention no? Get the hell out of there. Just just go to the front door and get out. Turn around. Mm, I'm turn around. <laughs> I love how slow I move. All right, get out of this hallway and then take a take your second right. Uh, Cause I'm slow and I don't want to. Okay, there's a there's a staircase. Take the staircase. Uh, and you should be next to uh, the fire escape. You should be able to get out that way. So so go up the staircase. Staircase. What staircase? Okay. Um.
That don't seem to be a viable option. Just saying. He just... Ghost girl, are you thick? Starts playing fucking... Oh, God. My mouse is not staying in the game. No. 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 Oh, no. You guys sound like fucking cows from Minecraft. No. Oh, yay, PT. Ghost girl, are you single? Dude, you're telling me, man. Talk about getting ghosted, am I right? <laughs> it's 8.17. Do I go this way? That was cheap. That was cheap. Fuck you, game. <sighs> oh, you guys are a fucking mess. You licking my feet down there? Where'd you go? How did you already get... I don't know what touched my feet then. If you, if you, 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 you didn't move. The fuck touched my foot? I don't understand. Did you lick my feet? You were under my desk initially, but it seemed like you were sitting over there for quite a while because you were asleep. I think I was right next to you too. Now I'm curious. Did you lick my feet? Ghost girl went into his house and not beast. Bullshit. Can't have no one. 
She'll be my girlfriend now? What the fuck? She has a foot fa What is happening right now? It's gonna be another cheap jump scare, ain't it? Uh... I don't like this. Look at the floor. Hold me tight, Aiko. Hold me tight. I'm scared because I'm a little bitch right now. I don't know. Something has me on edge. Yeah. Ice, Aiko, buddy. Can you turn around? Can you turn? <laughs> Scribeway. Look at me, laddies. What are you doing? Get off my bed. Get off my bed. You little fuck. Come here. Come here. Come here. You little shit. It's gonna be another cheap jump scare, man. I don't like this. I don't like this fucking game. What the fuck am I supposed to do? what I'm supposed to do. There's nothing in the window. There's no... Fuck! No eyes don't see. Clive was more than just a mere man. 
and uh, he would kind of haunt this patient all throughout the day, you know, rampant hallucinations that progressively got worse, but at night he never saw the peeper. Then he discovered that if he closed his eyes, he could escape Clive, but whenever he opened them, Clive would be there, waiting for him and getting closer and closer. Eventually, the patient used a fork and he blinded himself. And while he was soaked in his blood from his sockets, he screamed to the entire hospital that he was free, he was safe. And a week later, two more patients charged Clive with stalking them, even though he was confined to solitary. I mean, it's crazy. They, they took their eyesights, too. His pattern didn't stop. I thought it was BS, but based on what we've seen tonight, I don't pretty much believe anything. So, try to get the hell out of there, and if it gets too intense, try to shut your eyes. I don't like this guy I work for. I really don't. Can I shut my eyes? Can I close my eyes as I walk through the halls? He said try to shut your eyes. Is that not feasible? Is that not an option? Let me just backtrack here. Let me just. Run! Run, dude! Oh my god! You gotta get out of there! Oh no! I, can't I didn't run. That. You <coughs> your eyes out with a scalpel. I'm a goddamn pussy for right? like being so bitchy in the beginning. I know you're not. Hunt. Holy crap! All right, all right. We're, we're we're getting a picture from your camera. Bad news is it's pitch black. There there's no light. Your room. There's nothing I could see. The flashlight went out, and and we we don't even know where you are. I'm not going in there. I, I, do you, are you going in there? I'm not going in there. I'm, hell no. Look, uh, I'm, if you can't feel anything, I, I'm sorry, but we're not coming. I'm sorry, man. I have to go. I'm sorry. You guys are fucking dicks.
I can't even like get out of this. All right. Well, that is the end of it today, folks. So, in that case, you know what to do? Join the Discord. Follow me on Twitch. The Thursday. Not Thursday, sorry. Friday? Today's Thursday, right? Yeah, today's Thursday. Um, Friday... I don't know what I'll be doing Friday. I, I haven't really decided. I think I'll do the Madvent Friday and go through all the games on that, as well as the Putt-Putt game. Saturday, we're doing Code Veronica, and Sunday... I don't know what Sunday will be. Probably art with me, as usual. Um, if you like the content, suck my butt. Uh, join the Discord. Uh, follow me on Twitch. The usual. Links to these games will be down below. Y'all had to watch me be a bitch for like two minutes over a really crappy game, and I feel bad now. So I'm gonna go wash the shame off by playing a game or something. I don't know. I'll see you guys in the next video and see all of you in who are chatting in stream in the next stream. So, uh, peace out, guys.